Hey what's up you guys, it's Jackson and welcome back to another video. So it looks like I'm in heaven right now, y'all know I ain't going there. Anyway, but uh, I'm trying out a new backdrop thing with new lights that my brother let me use. So if you like it, give it a thumbs up. It also helps with the YouTube algorithm, so it helped me get a bit more recognition. So if you want to help me get some recognition, give this video a thumbs up. Also subscribe down below for more videos and shiz. Right now I'm procrastinating study for exams that start in a week. So motivated. So in the recent few weeks, I've seen uh, a couple of trans YouTubers react to this guy. I think his name is like The Amazing Lucas or something. And eventually, I just kind of gave in and was like, you know what? We're going to look at some of this guy's videos and see what's going on. So I was scrolling through his uh, his YouTube feed and I saw a video called A uh, Mam Walks Into Hospital. Like the way, like Mayum or whatever way they pronounce it in America. Um, and I was like, oh. It's a transphobic video. So I decided instead of watching it, I was gonna react to it in a video. So here we go, enjoy. This is the amazing Lucas's video called A Mam Walks Into a Hospital. I think that's what it's called? Yeah, that's what it's called. Forgot to add in, the basics of the video is a trans man went into labor in a hospital and he decided to make a video about it. So again, I haven't watched it. So I'm gonna leave some room for y'all to see it as well. Bruh. This may be the craziest story you will hear in your entire life. Oh my goodness. So guys, I don't know if you've heard this story, but when I was reading it, I couldn't believe what I was reading. I feel like I'm saying that more than ever in 2019, and I think it's sad. I'm reading the story by AP. And in, in, in the first paragraph, the first paragraph is like, yo, this man comes into the hospital with abdominal pains, right? He's like, oh, it hurts, it hurts. We come to find out that, you know, he hasn't been taking his, 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 blood, his, his blood pressure medicine and he's a little obese. So the nurses are like, okay, we, you know, we'll figure this out. It's nothing crazy, right? We then come to find out, I kid you not, this is what they wrote. This is what they wrote in AP. They said that in reality, he was pregnant. Why'd you say that so much? What? I'm sorry, but what do you mean? In reality, he was pregnant. No, 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 no. In, you mean in reality, he was in fact a she. That's what's, is it, is this hate speech now? Is this where we're at right now? Where we, where we can't even acknowledge that, hey, women get pregnant, men don't get pregnant. This is not, this is not hate speech, this is just science. This is science, people. What is wrong with the world today? And, but the thing what triggered me, the thing that really just, just. Oh, you're triggered. I, I almost had like, just, just a breakdown reading this, is that they tried to put the blame on the hospital. They, think about that. Think about that. What do they always say? What does, what does the community always say? Use my pronouns, use my pronouns. I just want you to use my pronouns. Yeah, 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 right, right. So they come finally, finally, that's what the hospital does. They're like, sir, sir, are you okay? You're having abdominal pains? Okay, we're gonna figure it out. So now they treat you like a man. You wanna blame them for treating you like a man? They had the audacity to talk about, oh, this tragic case goes to show how transgenders are treated in the medical community. This is, what, this, this is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm talking about. You give them an inch, they take a mile. You give them an inch, they take a mile. A mile. This is loot. My mom came in to check if I was okay. That was good timing. I'm not with this video. Lunacy. I'm done. I've had it up to here. I've had it up to here. It's not funny anymore. So what? So what now? I go into a hospital, get a, a regular checkup. They're gonna force me to do a mammogram? Is that, is that, is that what it's gotten to? Um, sir, we're gonna have to do a mammogram. I don't want a mammogram. I'm a man. I don't have, I don't have breasts. I have a chest. Sir, just for our liability, we have to do a mammogram. Five hours later. This is what it's gotten. This, this is, this is the craziness that it's gotten to. Where they're talking about, well, they, the medical medical field needs to understand how diverse humans really are. What do you mean? What are you talking about, player? What, what are you What are you talking about? You get the thing is, can we? Can we? You're telling me 
that we can't even establish that men can't get pregnant? That's what you want to tell me? That we have to be so inclusive. Inclusive. That we now have to say, well, men can get pregnant. Some men can get pregnant. Then they're not men. Why is this so controversial? I don't get it. Ladies, ladies, think about what they're saying. <laughs> think about what they're saying. As a man, I mean, what do I do? I shoot my shot, a baby comes out in nine months. That's just, just, just right. I don't, I'm not carrying the baby. You are. So it's like, okay, right? But now they want to say we're on equal playing fields when it comes to giving life. I will be the first man to tell you, hey, I can't, I can't, I, I don't have a baby. I can't have a baby. You guys remember, you guys remember the video I did when they were talking about how they want to put in artificial wounds on, in men? Yo, yo, you, you ladies keep letting this happen. You ladies keep letting this happen and see what happens. See what happens. See, you, you, you want to talk about the dark ages. Oh, you'll be in the dark ages, all right. <laughs> you, you, you'll be in the dark ages, all right, when there won't be anything special about you. There won't be anything special. She'd be like, well, I can have children. And so can I. Well, I, I menstruate. So can I. Well, I, I have breasts. So do I. <laughs> this, this, is this the world that you want? Is this the world you want? I don't want to live in this world. I'm sorry. I'll be, I'll, you call me whatever you want. The phobia is all that. I don't want to live in this world. Because what they do, they say the man gets pregnant and then go on to use he pronouns. I thought we've already established in the first paragraph that this clearly isn't a he. I, I'm, 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 I'm confused. I'm frustrated. I'm tired. I'm hungry. I, I, what is it? <laughs> I don't get it anymore. I don't. I really don't. I really, I, it, it blows my mind. It blows my mind. What, it, it reminds me, you want to know what this, this incident reminds me of? It reminds me of the meme <laughs> that, that was circulating. You know the dude in GameStop, the ma'am, it's ma'am. It was a meme of him where it's like, uh, excuse me, doctor, it's ma'am. And the doctor's like, um, oh, well, well ma'am, you have testicular cancer. <laughs> Stop it. I, I, I can't. I can't anymore. No moss. No moss. I can't. I can't take it anymore. I can't take this lunacy. I can't take it anymore. And then they want to talk about your erasing my existence. What do you mean? What do you want from us? Huh? What do you want from us? I don't get it. I don't get why 99.9% .9 of the population is catering to this point zero 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 one percent I don't understand. That makes no sense. Makes no sense to me. This is the result of science being politicized. That, that is it. This is the end outcome. That you think about, think about being a doctor or being a nurse and you potentially being sued for malpractice because you didn't think the male patient who's been male on his chart, who has male on his driver's license, who has male in some places you can change, I believe you can change your birth certificate to, to represent your identity. Male, 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 male. You as a doctor forget to do, you know what? Maybe this male could actually be pregnant. Bruh. Bruh. For those of you who are wondering, yes, this, this right here, this is full retard. Anyways, guys, that's the video. Let me know what you guys think. Whether or not you believe, no, there is no, there is no either or. Here, I'm sorry. If you believe this is okay, if you, you believe this is all right to vilify and criticize a hospital for, 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 for not thinking that a man could be pregnant, then you're an idiot. Then you should not reproduce. Your genes, the gene pool, someone should put bleach in that gene pool. I'm sorry, there is no either or. Like, e e e e no, stop it. Stop with this foolishness. I've had it, I'm done. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not succumbing to your little fantasy anymore. Not that I had been anyways, but still, that's besides the point.
Just cut it out. Right, so that was a lot. Like, a lot. I have never watched any of the videos that I saw on this guy, but like, after watching that, I kind of get the hype now of why he's such an asshole. Like, this dude is like completely transphobic to a point where it's kind of funny of on like how much he doesn't want to be educated or how much he doesn't want to accept trans people. It's actually quite hilarious. Like, <laughs> what? <laughs> so, yeah, I'm kind of at a loss for words at that. My voice keeps cracking. Um, that was. He really hates us, wow. He was like, I don't know why the 99.9% .9 is catering to that like 0.01%. And I'm like, well, maybe because we're so small, we'd like a bit of representation and help. Cause clearly people aren't very educated as you've just showed us. <laughs> this guy has like, I think nearly like 400,000 subscribers, which is quite worrying because you know, he's, given out a lot of negative information and a lot of negative viewpoints of the trans community, which isn't fun. Um, so that's like great crack. I, I, know, I know I didn't really say anything through the video. I just wanted to give you my expressions, what I normally do for a reaction video, but like, wow, he just, he just really doesn't like trans people. That's crazy. I've never seen someone so passionate about people being accepting of trans people and he just didn't like it. Like, he was like, oh my God, they said he was pregnant and then kept using he pronouns. Like he is clearly a she and I'm like, but you're still calling him he. I don't get your point here of what you're trying to say. I, th I think he just thinks he's so right in everything that he says. He's like, bruh, bruh, you feel me? Like, bruh, like, you know, they're clearly women and men when they say they're not, or they say they are. Like, oh, he's just wrong. Like, dude, stop. I normally just don't react to these kinds of things, but he, pff, wow, he really blew me out, out of the water. That was, didn't expect <laughs> that. I expected maybe, you know, like, oh my God, I can't believe they were giving out about a man getting pregnant or something. I just didn't expect him to be like that bad. like. Wow, dude's got issues. But yeah, I hope to never cross Lucas in my life. He's a dickhead. And <laughs> um, if you want me to react to more of his videos in the future, because personally, I won't be reacting to them unless you guys want me to, because I won't be watching them, because I don't want to give him credit for this shit. Um, but if you want to see me react to more of his videos, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. And um, like I said, it helps the... What's the word again? Algorithm, that's all it is. It helps the algorithm, it helps me out, and it helps me get more noticed, and so I can keep making videos for you guys and help grow the family and stuff. So yeah, it would be great if you could give this video a thumbs up. So that's it for this video. Hope you enjoyed. I really didn't because that was, it was actually quite funny. I'm not gonna lie. It's, it's funny that some people think that way. Like there's a lot of people out there that think that way. It's, it's kind of crazy. I hope you had, have, or having an amazing day. I'll see you in the next video. Quote and Ellen, be kind to one another. Don't be a Lucas. And yeah, peace.